through the class welcome to another segment of online teaching today date is been 7th may 2020 the subject we have is english studies that is meant for those in grade 6 the topic is a uh, syllabification what is a uh, syllabification syllabification is uh, the division of words according to their syllabus last time we switched the uh, types of syllable uh, when you identify words, it can be monosyllabic, bisyllabic, or polysyllabic. By being monosyllabic, it means that the words in question have one syllables. Words that are of one syllable are called monosyllabic. Words, words that are made up of two syllables are called bisyllabic or disyllabic words. Words that are of uh, that of two or more syllables, three or more syllables are called polysyllabic words. Words well, well, that of three or more syllables are called polysyllabic words. Today we are going to select five words. And from these examples we have on the board, uh, it will serve as a guide on how you can select five words. Examples number one, vento. Uh, the, the way you pronounce it to enable you to identify the word vendo. Now, in each label, there must be a vowel, right? Vendo. There is a vowel here, e. There is a vowel here, o. So this word is a uh, bisyllabic. It has two syllables. Now, number two, sponsor. Sponsor. This. All these two has also, uh, this number two has two syllables. Sponsor is also called by syllabic word. Number three, letter. Letter. Now let me guide you on how to do this. Number three. In number three, if you have two consonant letters following one another, you have to split the two so that the two will not remain one syllable. That is how you arrive at this number three. Letter. It has two syllables also. Then number four, dramatic. Now it's dramatic. It is a polysyllabic word because it has three syllables. Number five, democracy. Yes. Democracy. It has four syllables. Yeah, we call it polysyllabic word. Number six, imagination. Imagination. It has five syllables. We call it a polysyllabic word. Number seven, adventure. Adventure. It has three syllables. We also call it a polysyllabic word. Number eight, psychology. Psychology. It has four syllables. We call it a polysyllabic word. Number nine. Ambassador. Ambassador. It has four syllables. We call it a polysyllabic word. Now, just like the rule of number four, three here, is also applicable in number nine, where you have to separate two similar consonants. S, like as an ambassador, you separate the two S so that the two S will not remain in one syllable. And you also observe that each syllable was contain a vowel. Number 10, ceremony. Ceremony, that is four syllables. It's also a polysyllabic word. Now, in our four words, we are going to syllabify these words. Ladder. Metaphor, photography, communication, matter. Now, if you have any question from the lesson or your homework, you send me a message through my WhatsApp number 080 365 Thank you.